Welcome. We're going to be doing a little behind the scenes look at the preparation for my uh, next Amazon fishing trip, uh, which is a little more than a month away. Uh, so I have uh, three different um, Orvis fishing rods here. Two of them have been actually repaired from the last trip. And we're going to unbox these fly rods, the two repairs, go through and show what the damage was and how Orvis did the repairs. Okay, and then we'll look at the new one that I'm taking for the trip. So as you can see here on this one, as you can see here on this one, they uh, already said your fly rod is back and better than ever. This was repaired by Orvis. I have the, the order number for two of the repair jobs here. Broken tip, okay. And they sent them back, not necessarily with the same containers that the rod is, because I did not send my containers over. So uh, my rods were recons. They sent back uh, an encounter on a clear water um, tube. It doesn't make a difference. I, it doesn't bother me. Uh, but let's go through here and look at this fly rod that, that Orvis repaired. Now all my fly rods have a 25 year uh, warranty, which basically in effect for me in my early 60s, is for all practical purposes a, a lifetime warranty. So um, set this up here. And now we're going to take this fly rod out of its tube, okay? And this here was the five weight that I had sent to them to be repaired. And this was in my original sleeve, okay? That, that was sent in a packing tube. So the beauty with Orvis fly rods is it comes with a, a lifetime warranty. So this tip was broken and it got broke in the Amazon and they completely replaced this section and they did a tune up on the ferrules and the guides on the other four sections. And this is my five weight that I took to the uh, Monkey Howler Lodge on the Rio Gariba. And you can see here, this is a Orvis. Let me turn it this way. You can see here, this is an Orvis five weight, nine foot recon. This is made in the United States, 25 year warranty. They cleaned everything up from uh, the, the jungle expedition. So I'm gonna just put these aside for the moment. And I will wrap these up and put these back properly. Uh, in storage. This five weight is not going to the Amazon next month. Here is the other fly rod that was repaired. All right, so let's open this. This is in my recon, Orvis recon uh, sleeve that I did send them. And this one here is my Orvis recon uh, nine foot six weight. Okay, so for this last trip, I took a five and six weight fly rod, both of which unfortunately got damaged. And we'll talk about that in a moment. And again, Orvis fine-tuned the ferrules, updated and fine-tuned the uh, guides on the rod, all the different pieces, make sure everything is in excellent order. This tip, this tip on my six weight recon was smashed they replaced this whole piece here, new. And uh, my six weight, and the six weight is also not going to Brazil this time because I'm taking two eight weight rods. I'm taking an eight weight recon and I'm taking a brand new eight weight clear water. And um, this way I could have two rods rigged up with two different reels, two different fly lines, one a floating, one a sinking tip. So I don't have to swap out things and I could be very, very efficient in um, the Rio Negro. So let's look at the new eight weight rod. Here is the new fly rod. And you can see they even tell you here to, they even tell you here to register your rod, which I will do uh, certainly uh, before I head out on the trip. So this is an unboxing of uh, an Orvis eight weight clear water rod, okay, that I did purchase from Orvis. I haven't taken this out of the tube yet. So let's do this. 
seems like they, they kind of changed the tubes a little bit. This one has a built-in sleeve, which I'll show you as soon as I take everything out. All right. So I got the four pieces out. You can see this tube has a, um, a foam protector. It has the sleeve already built in with the components that slide in and out. So that's an excellent tube. Here is the butt section. And you can see here, it says Orvis Clearwater, which is a great rod. It's not expensive. So this one's not made in the United States, but it comes with that same 25 year warranty. And you can see here, it is a uh, nine foot eight weight. Here is the second section, nice and sturdy, brand stinking new. This is gonna be awesome on the Rio Negro for giant three barred peacock bass. Here is the upper midsection. Everything is perfectly aligned. And here is the tip section that I'm gonna take extra special care not to, not to break. So I'm taking two, so for this trip to uh, the Rio Negro in January of uh, 24, I'm taking two eight weight fly rods. One is this one here, the uh, clear water eight, eight weight. And I have a, a, a matching reel on a clear water reel with a sinking tip. And I have um, in the house, I have my eight weight recon with the hydro four reel and that has a um uh floating uh line and so those are the two weapons on the fly rods that i will be taking uh to the amazon and as you can see here we have uh the equipment laid out that we just went through and um to say that i'm stoked for this trip is an understatement i was in brazil um in august and i can't wait to go back uh fishing again so until then we'll have some more behind the scenes uh fishing tips for this upcoming trip but until then tight lines everybody